Guys, just want to give you a quick rundown of the week, so let's jump into the weight like we usually do. So this week, my weight's been between 84.2 to 84.9 kilograms, so it's roughly 185 to 187 pounds. Again, this is a slight increase on last week based on that lowest number of where I was last week. A bit hard to see how much of a weight gain due to the fluctuation I had of being super hydrated, super dehydrated last week due to the weather. So I think I've definitely gained a little bit, but either way, if I haven't, I'm still quite happy because I can just build on this week, next week. Moving on from there, my calories have been around 3,650 calories. I'll put the actual number on the screen here. But I'm quite happy with this because it guarantees that I keep gaining weight. Maybe not the same rate as I was, but I keep gaining weight. Moving on from there, my macros have been around 195 grams of protein, 290 grams of carbs, and 165 grams of fats. So I'll put the actual breakdown on the screen here, but I'm quite happy with this because it's still at least two grams per kilogram of body weight for protein, and I'm still getting in enough carbs and a good amount of fats to keep moving forward and pushing and having the energy to do what I need to do. So this week I did have a bit of a slip up and I did start bringing down the weight a little bit for the first few days of the week. That's mainly because I started to have a racing heart from Friday to Sunday. It sort of went away after that and I think it scared me a little bit so I thought I'd drop a little bit of weight off, clean up and go but I then sort of regained it and what decided I was going to push just at a slower rate in terms of weight gain and I think it's, that was mainly the reason but I think the other reason was probably just bulking messing in my head a little bit which is what happens it's not just when you cut it's when you go on a bulk sometimes you can let it mess with your head a little bit and I think I did but now I've regained and got control of the situation. Moving on from there, I've decided that I'm only going to be gaining 0.2 to 0.3 of a kilogram per week. So that's why my calories dropped down to 3,650 calories because this is around the number it should be for me to gain that much. Again, I'm going to be testing it out next week as well. And if I need to, I'll bump it up to reach that range. But I will no longer be trying to gain half a kilo per week. It'll be 0.2 of a kilo to 0.3 of a kilo per week. <clears throat> and finally, the ink anxiety or the anxious feelings I had whilst wearing a vest in the gym have pretty much gone like I was wearing it on Friday and completely zoned in on my workout like tunnel vision focused on what I needed to do so I didn't really notice anyone or anything going on around me whereas when I did feel anxious and sort of paranoid that people were watching me I was constantly looking around trying to see if people were watching me but I no longer really notice or even care so anxious feelings pretty much gone finally <clears throat> I wanted to ask a question because I'm just interested do you also find it a little bit annoying when people ring you whilst you're in the gym training and it's not an emergency I just wanted to know because I personally get a little bit annoyed and just think why don't you just text me but I wanted to know what you lot think so let me know down in the comments below and finally if you've enjoyed this video guys can i get you to leave me a like by hitting that thumbs up button subscribing if you're not already so you never miss another video and most importantly enjoy the rest of your day and i will see you in the next one Take me to Neverland.